Hey guys, Tumbleweed and I are out here at an undisclosed location in uh, Colorado. And we're gonna go for a ride. Andrew just got a brand new 2021 TC250. Uh, and I'm on the 125 XC. Uh, we got that jetted, which should be good. It's really cold. It's about 27 degrees, 28 degrees right now. So kind of hoping that sun's gonna come up and warm things up. Uh, but yeah, let's go have some fun, guys. Up, it's gonna be perfect, but I'm freezing like freezing my hands. That is, how's it feel? <laughs> I love it. I definitely want to get a bigger brake pedal. I'm so used to my other one being big, it's like, fuck, where is that? Yeah, I know. Gonna be putting uh, the RK hat on. Uh, he broke the subframe and they're backordered. So to get a subframe, he bought another motorcycle. Really proud of him for that. That's the best decision making I've ever heard of. And uh, <laughs> uh, so yeah, this is his first ride. It's first, way snappier. Yeah, way snappier. It's got a Makuni TMX. We put the JD uh, kit in it. Red Needle number two. I think he's running a four. 30 or 420 uh, main jet actually 420 main jet 35 pilot. I think we need to go up to a 38 um, But uh, yeah, 
running pretty good except for that idle, right? Yeah. Yeah. And it's a motocross bike. They're not really made to idle anyway. <laughs> um, but the, I can say right now the head, like it's, we're barely into this thing, but the head on this thing makes a huge difference. Really, really happy about that. A lot more bottom end. Uh, the jetting is different. I'll put the numbers here on the screen, uh, what we got in here. Um, but I think the jetting sounds pretty good. What do you guys think? Um, and I'm just, honestly, I'm killing time because I want that sun to come here. <laughs> My hands are freezing. <laughs> uh, but yeah, this place is awesome. Let's go have some fun. The first crash! The it soft! Kept screwing up, dude. <laughs> oh, that was awesome. <laughs> I'm gonna change something on the front end of this thing. God, it feels like I don't know if it's me or the tire or what, but it feels super skatey. Yeah, the front end is like I don't know. I didn't really, I don't think I changed anything, but it's a lot rockier than it was before you know last week and it's just like doo -doo -doo -doo. So i'm trying to see if we can't slow that down a little bit so, what i did to the front end is i slowed the rebound down it just felt like it turned it was Do the same thing I did to the 
front to the back that's way better yeah you know <laughs> It's amazing what a well-tuned carburetor will do. So guys, I know I'm out here fiddling with a motorcycle, which I generally tell people not to do, but since it's brand new and I'm trying to figure everything out, you gotta. I fell behind because I wanted to do that drop. Everybody, my fancy pants skid plate came off. All right, everybody watching, look what happened to the Acherbus skid plate. Wait, but I just don't want it rattling. I thought it hurt it. <laughs> Scratched him up. Fuck me. Oh, yeah. I'm glad you're okay. That's a pretty good one, dude. God damn it. It's all right.
but honestly, it handles pretty good. Uh, especially since it's like the rear end is set up for like a 150 pound dude. So I'm a solid 40 pounds overweight. <laughs> So, I mean, it's actually doing pretty good. The airport, I feel like they're all right. Again, they're not my favorite. They're a little harsh, but whatever. guys poor tumbleweed <laughs> broke the bike well, i didn't break the bike he just broke some plastic but uh other than that part how did you like it i loved it the carburetors i mean honestly way better than the fuel injected yes thank you thank you this is from a man who owns two 2021 husqvarna's 1300 i it's a tx so it's the racy one and then this is a tc and uh, all we did was JD put my recipe for jetting and it ran great. We might have to fiddle with the idle circuit a little bit, but you know, whatever. The, uh, I just have to say real fast guys, this RK had, thank you, uh, Kelsey at RK Tech. I seriously did not think you guys could make this 125 that much more fun to ride, but it's even better. Still revs all the way to the moon. Uh, but it just has that grunt down low that a 125 doesn't have and then plus the DDC uh, racing the Delaney, Delaney drive components DDC uh, rear sprocket going up one tooth um, that combination on this thing is absolutely brilliant uh, like I said check the description below I'll put the jetting specs that are in this thing I'll tell you right now it is a 450 main jet a 35 pilot and the JD needle in the number three position, and I think it's perfect. I'm not touching it, uh, at least not for a while. Uh, I really like the way it runs. Um, yeah, guys, hope you guys like that. Hope you get out, spread the gospel two wheels, and as always, you know what I'm going to say. I hope that we're inspiring you guys to get out and ride your dirt bikes! Mm -hmm.